Japan's history as news. You are there. Welcome and thank you for joining us at Aduchi Momoyama Star on February 28 in the year 1591. On this date, Senrikyu committed suicide. Let's learn about the man and the reasons for his death. Who is Senrikyu? Senrikyu was born into a wealthy merchant family in Sakai. Also, his grandfather was a tea protocol advisor to the shogun Ashikaga Yoshimatsu. Shogun. <laughs> so, he was familiar with matters concerning tea from a very early age. He was the tea master who served under Totomi Hideyoshi. Three reasons why Sandy Kyo committed ritual suicide. One. Totomi was jealous of Senrikyu's popularity. 2. Senrikyu rejected Totomi's request for his daughter's hand in marriage. 3. The differences between their sensibilities. Differences Totomi's tea house. What does his choice of tea house tell us about him? Totomi liked luxury, so he was proud as a peacock. Senrikyu's tea house. What does his choice of tea house tell us about him? He didn't use anything unnecessarily. He might be considered a minimalist. Comparing the two styles, the left shows that Teotomi used a lot of gold and he utilized tools which came from China. They were very big, gorgeous, and expensive. The right shows Riku used stone and bamboo. These utensils were common man's tools of hum humble wood. They were all made in Japan. What are the fundamentals of Senrikyu's art of tea? He perfected a simple style of tea ceremony, Wabicha. He decorated the alcove with one beautiful seasonal flower. He held a tea ceremony in a simple tea room. He served Totomi Hideyoshi. Conclusion Looking at today's three schools in the art of the tea ceremony, how is his family connected to these schools of tea? The three schools Omote Senke, Ura Senke, and Yushakoji Senke were established by Senrikyu's grandsons, Genpaku Sotan's own sons. Genpaku was the son of Senrikyu's daughter Okame. If Hideyoshi had married Okame at his home, perhaps Senrikyu's style of tea would have been lost. Thank you for listening and good evening.